नीलाचल निवासा नित्याय परमात्म ने बलभद्र सुभद्रा जगन्नाथ आय दे मोर परम आराध्य ठाकुर श्री अभियाम परमश चरण तेल अनंत कोटि प्रणाम आपण मानक धर्ज ना मोर भी धर्ज ना नौटा बेल ठार बस तेणु मुझे जिते दूर संभव संक्षिप्त भाई मत कह चिफ गेस्ट थे मोर से कलिग थे रेभेन सर तेणु से कह पांच मिनट भितर सार तेणु मुझे पांच मिनट कौन चार मिनट सार दूस तेणु चेयरपर्सन डक्टर मिश्र एस्टेड विभूत बाबू एवं ऑल द डिग्नेज ऑफ द डाइस एंड माय फ्रेंड्स नाइ नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट ह्यूमन वैल्यूज इन द क्रिएशन और वर्क्स ऑफ द अभिराम लिटरेचर मत जहाँ लगला अधिकांश आलोचक ह्यूमन वैल्यूज विषय जाणी ना केवल के छाड़ीदे ह्यूमन भैल्यूज न कहीं मोरालीटी कही चल अभिराम परमश मोरालीटी अनेक आलोचक आप लक्ष्य करते हैं तेणु ह्यूमन भैल्यूज कौन से कथ आग मुझे डिस्कसन करने को चाहिए ह्यूमन भैल्यूज मीनस द बेसिक इनहरेन्ट भैल्यूज इन ह्यूमन इनक्लूड ट्रुथ अनेस्टी लयालीटी लव पीस इट्सेटा ये गुड़क हूँ ह्यूमन भैल्यूज दिस भर्चुज ब्रिंगस आउट द फंडामेटाल गुडने अफ ह्यूमान बींगस एंड सोसायटी आट लार्ज इन अदर वार्डस ह्यूमान भैल्यूज आर द क्यारेक्टरिस्टिक्स अफ गड इन ह्यूमान कंडीशन गड पोस्टुलेटेड ह्यूमान भैल्यूज सच एज लव ट्रुथ रईट एक्शन पीस नन भायोलेन्स इट्सेट्रा उद इन इच भैल्यूज दैर इज ए रेज अफ सब भैल्यूज Human values are the virtues that guide us to take into account the human element when we interact with other human beings. Respect, acceptance, consideration, appreciation, listening to others, open openness, affection, empathy, and love towards other human beings, love of truth and peace, right conduct, peaceful. Co coexistence, discipline, manner are the essence of human values. This is called humanism or universal humanism. This human values expressed by Thakur Sir Abhiram Parmanshadev in two ways. Do it a upare prakash teche tankar saitha. By theory and by practice, he showed the human values in his literary, literary works as well as in his social activities. and advice he advised to his followers or disciples through his literature was based on practice which he named as experience or realization anubhav so he told that realization is truth anubhav ko satya kahi all his spiritual literature are based on practical realization मुशीघ्र सार चेषा कर ठाकुर जो ह्यूमन भैल्यूज कथा आम देखुचे ह्यूमन भैल्यूज केमी साहित्य अच्छी लिटरेचर अच्छी से कहीं आणले से गुड़ा कहीं ठाकुर लोक मान पाख को आथम तापर लोक जाइंट ठाकुर पाख को उन्नीस छब्बीस मसीहा ठार उश तेतीस मसीहा पर्यटन ठाकुर भ्रमण से जा From 1926 to 1933, Thakur Sir Abhiram went to various places in Odisha. Some of them are mission, ordinary people are mission. Money is a common thing. They are not money or values of position. He has been walking from village to village in crowds of disciples and monks, and has mingled with various people of the society. He has pressed. the vedic religion in an easy and simple form in scientifically sound manner he has integrated himself with the people of the countryside sadharan lokam sang mission 
He has sung the music of social human life. He has instructed the way to transform from a caged creature into a free creature. He taught ideals and morals. He taught spirituality and how to lead a divine, peaceful life. In his vision, in his eternal creation, there is a message of common communism for the human society. Samadha drushti, man is the child of God. Therefore, he advised to respect each other in the society. He pressed advice to end the time in peace and joy by adopting truth, peace, mercy, forgiveness in the social life. Which are the intrinsic value? He established Shanti Ananda Ashram in his native place Karamala to save people who were trapped in sins and inhuman activities. Thakur's Ravhiram Paramahamsa, the wonder of 20th century, he is the speaker of truth, peace and joy. He is the eternal truth, Satya Narayana, Sri Ravhiram Paramahamsa Dev, who was concerned for the entire world and who continue to strive for the spiritual development of man was the originator of great universalism, the humanity, humanist, immortal, safer, Divya Chetana Thakur. As the reformer of Satya Sanatana Dharma, he established his universal love on our Vedic Upanishadic tradition. This universalism is the great humanistic vision. This soil is the soil of sex, land of munis, rushis, siddhas, sadhus, santas. This soil of Bharata is the sacred soil. This is where God has assumed various avatars and has given the light of wisdom to mankind. He has directed the path of salvation. Thakur Abhiram Paramahamsa who appeared in that tradition gave the message of humanism on the spiritual ground. Humanism refers to human qualities that are not passive. Truth, peace, mercy, forgiveness are the crown of humanism. There is no place of ego, anger, lust, pride, malice, violence, hatred, selfishness, etc. On that day, addressing all the people of the world as Amrut Chat, children or, or Amruta Santan. The Vedas said, all human beings in the world are created by God, all are equal. There is affection, love, peace, joy for the entire human society, for the whole world. Eastern humanism binds man in a bond of friendship and establishes universal brotherhood. On that day, Considering the entire world or Vasudha as one family, Vedic saints chanted, Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha, Sarve Santu Niramaya, Sarve Bhadrani Pasyantu, Mahakar Siddhu Gohak Bhave. Even in Jajur Veda, expressing humanistic ideas, Vedic Rushi sings, O highest authority God, all creatures look at me with friendly eyes, I see all beings as friends, we see each other with friendly eyes in the peace mant mantras of Jajur Veda. And Atharva Veda Vedic saints have prayed to Lord Brahma for the happiness of whole world. So it seems that humanistic thought is not only a thought of modern times. It has been established in our social tradition since time immor immemorial. But in modern times, when the human value of the so-called materialistic man is de decreasing, he is suffering from lost ego, anger and greed, and then the question of humanism is arising. Today, corruption, injustice and tyranny are spreading around. In this context, Thakur's Aviram Paramahamsa Dev appeared as an angel of heaven to invite us to the voice of humanism 
as the guardian of our ancient tradition. When there is a crisis in the world, God's offspring come down into the human society in order to save people. Thakur Abhiram has adopted common people as his own. Sri Thakur raised his voice against untouchability. He loves people. He has heard the pain of the suffering soul. He has embraced everybody by his arms as his devotee. He taught that human service is spiritual service. In his opinion, if the body is not engaged in human service or Bhagavad karma, then the life is useless. Sri Thakur has advised to avoid all dirty deeds and behave in a manner of truth, peace, mercy and forgiveness. In his language, this incarnation of Narayan himself will sit in the holy temple of body in the day when man will practice truth, peace, mercy, forgiveness, etc. Then one can go and attain eternal peace and supreme happiness. Spiritual consciousness should be awakened in him. So, Sri Thakur has first given many insights about Param Brahma Paramatma. Sri Thakur said, keep Satyananda, Santyananda, Dayananda and Khyamananda by holding four remains dwelling in Nityananda. Satyananda, Santyananda, Dayananda, Dharo, Khyamananda, Chari, Dharuna, Raha, Nityananda. May, be, may the whole man attain eternal peace and joy. This is what a human history writer and world-loving seer can say. Sri Thakur emphasized humanism in his religious philosophy and mentioned about equality, non-violence and truthfulness. Sri Thakur said that great humanism and equa equanimity will arise in man when he realizes that Hari exists in all things. All are children of Hari, Sri Hari. Same kind of blood flows in everyone's body. According to humanists, the world is not unreal. All men are equal. All men are equal there. Violence, hatred, untruth are not there. Accordingly, Sri Thakur says, since God is present everywhere, all at all times, the world is not unreal. Sri Thakur says, don't love violence and mandacious Mendacious love, non-violence and truth because Krishna is present in everybody. Sanatana Dharmartha Gita, page 5. For humanistic generosity to awaken in man, he must first give up pride and arrogancy. He who is proud as I do is a fool. He is Chandala. Those who abandon the sattvic of virtues and take refuge in the rajas and tamas are chandars. Thakur says, Tukara no chindhino mukare helu bhai tilu tahaku bolanti chandala tiyehi. Those who are egoistic and untruthfully leave mercy and indulge in avarice, anger, lust, etc., think that. The body is mine, the house is mine, the world is mine. They are ignorant, stupid, untouchable, striving for the peace of man. Sri Thakur in his Sana uh, Santisar Gita has given the ultimate introduction to the humanistic view. Kamakrutha Hingsa Marjadadi Yaku Asparsakoi. Satya Santi Daya Khyama Ahimsa Ko Sparsiya Bolena Kohi. After loving and worshipping everyone, humanity will awaken in every man. He will show compassion and respect even to non-human creatures. Sri Thakur advised to practice non-violence. Tell the truth with non-violence towards every creatures. Abandoning violence would have done everything. Having seen all the creatures like himself, Narayana has a lot of love in him. Sanatana Dharma Gita, 
Prusta Dui. Two. So Sri Thakur said that the generosity of man depends on its inner devotions or Sraddha Bhava. When Sraddha Bhava awakens in him, he considers everyone as his own. Starting from humans, when man realizes God or Param Brahma is equally residing in all persons, narrowness and selfishness will disappear him from him through truth, non-violence, behavior, his one view and humanistic thinking will be sharp and enlightened. He will consider all the people of the world as his own. He will be engrossed in him in universal love or great human love. Divya Darsi Sri Thakur observed that the proliferance of nuclear weapons on earth would one day destroy human civilization. It is enemy of humanism. So, in Sanatana Dharmatha Kita, it told, modern weapons are dangerous. If you throw it, all the countries will burn, all civilizations will be destroyed, the result will be only dust. The humanist Sri Thakur has become sensitive to such uncertain and precarious future of man. Therefore, peace and happiness are established in man. So Sri Thakur has advised everyone to do human work and to practice human religion. <coughs> Jagannath culture which praised universal brotherhood and universal friendship, symbol of harmony and integrity has been designed by Sri Abhiram as Abhiram Paramahamsa. Sri Jagannath is the only true Param Brahma in the devotional thoughts and the philosophy of Sri Abhiram. It is he who is described in Abhiram's writings as Bhava Vinodhya Bhakta Vassal. Therefore, in the Kali Bhagavata, he has pronounced Lord Jagannath as eternal truth and Anadi Narayana, Ananta Purushottama, you are true Lord Vishnu. Through the description of Jagannatha, Sri Abhiram has expressed his vision on the day when the consciousness of Jagannatha will manifest in man, the unity between nations and nations will be preserved. Then he will consider the whole world as his own. He will feel Vishwatara Mitra, Vishwatara Bandhu, Vishwata Ananda, Vishwadina Bandhu. Bhakti Kalor Part 1, page 55. The world is his friend. The world is his friend. The world is his joy. The world is his friend. <coughs> it is impossible to consider his socio-cultural and spiritual perspective separately social vision and cultural vision separated through his spiritual vision. But the main element of his vision is man. The man objective, the main objective of Sri Abhiram's philosophy is the transform him from unfined creature to a free creature in a healthy and beautiful social environment by bringing about spirituality in him. Thakur Sri Abhiram Paramahamsa was a progressive thinker with a modern mindset. His spiritual vision, social vision, cultural vision, realistic scientific vision and humanistic vision combined with the application of innovative ideas as are expressed in the every part of his creative work. The vision of a revolutionary divine sage has been revealed which is the welfare song of the universal humanism. So, Sri Thakur uttered, may all be happy, may all be happy, may all be healthy, may all be well, may, may anyone not be sad, 
सर्वे सुखी हूँ समस्त निरोग हो समस्त मंगल रुँ के दुखे न पड़तु सनातन धर्मार्थ गीता पेज सिक्सटीन थैंक यू वेरी मच सर्वे हूँ सुखी न सर्वे सन्तु निरामय सर्वे भद्राणी पश्यंत महाकर्षित दोहा